this is the fastest train in the world, with a record speed of 574.8 kilometres an hour. It's now being tested in the Czech Republic, near Prague. The AGV from French company Alstom still has to undergo many tests before it can be launched. The Czech Republic doesn't have any high-speed lines, but this 13-kilometre track at Velim is suitable for trials. We have a choice. We can also test it on commercial railways in France, but that causes major disruptions to the commercial network. So the best solution is to test it on a track. And today, in Europe, the only track which allows a speed of 200 km an hour is here, in Velim, in the Czech Republic. In four months of trials in the Czech Republic, all data has been analyzed in the laboratory car located in the middle of the Pegasus prototype, built in France in La Rochelle. We're now testing emergency braking to check if it stops according to our calculations. So far, the results have been OK, but they still need to be analysed by the French team in La Rochelle. The track is limited to 200 km per hour, so we'll have to do some high-speed tests in France. The train is designed for a top speed of 360 km per hour. One little problem on this Czech test track, animals crossing the railway. Ultrasound whistles had to be installed, and special protection has been put on the front of the train. In Velim, the engineers are French, but the driver is Czech. It's really different compared to the locomotives I am used to driving. With this train, I drive at 200 km per hour. People here can hardly believe it. Trials in Velim should last until September. Several potential clients are coming here to see how the AGV works. Among them, the Italian company NTV. It's bought the first 25 trains, which should go into service in 2011.